Well, we have a surprise today. Let's see what is this. Okay, this seems one McWheel. Whoa! And here there is another McWheel. I have two McWheels. Okay, I'm gonna show you exactly which is this. Okay, these are the Mac wheels. These are a powerful tool for urban surf and also filmmaking. Okay, for urban surf and filmmaking, these are the perfect tools. I was comparing these tools with uh, one wheel, but one wheel is more for jumping. It is a bit more dangerous, the one wheel, and this is more safe and it's perfect for my purpose, okay, for urban surf and uh, filmmaking. So I'm going to today to show you the unboxing of these uh, two uh, Urban Surf uh, electric scooters and of course there is the, the foam <laughs> in each uh, package and well uh, in this case I have the, the fenders. These are beautiful fenders and they come also with their screws and and you can find also a manual all in English language and very easy to, to read because this is full of pictures, you can see, okay? Uh, it is colored pictures and everything is perfectly explained, as you can see. So you can learn in just a few minutes how to use your, your trotter, okay? Your Mac wheel trotter. And this comes with um, a charger. The charger has indicator of of uh, charge, right? So there is a LED indicator. If it's in red color, this means that it is charging and when it's in green color, it is fully charged. I have leveled the voltage because I have two trotters and they have different voltage. Uh, in this case, this is a T2 and it is using a 67.2 volts. Okay, this is a charger. And then, okay, it is the Mac wheel, okay? Here it is the Trotter T2 Mac wheel. Uh, they have also provided me with um, a hang, this hang, as you can see, so you can carry it easily. And well, it's amazing. It's very beautiful. Uh, I was not expecting this so beautiful orange color, but I love it. It's beautiful. And now let's go to the other trotter, okay? In this case, this is a T1 uh, long haul, and it's uh, for long distance. And it is using, uh, the, the charger is very similar, but it has a different uh, volts. It's 54.6 volts, okay? And I have also a fender, also the instructions manual. It's exactly like the other, and the screws for the fender, and the Mac wheel. Here it is the Mac wheel. This is also beautiful, uh, black color. It's amazing, very beautiful. As you can see, it is. This is also important. Uh, the motor, you can see here, trotter leveled, and. Uh, in the other side of the motor, it's a good practice to place the hang, okay? I will explain you this uh, later now with the, uh, with the security of this product, okay? It is very, very secure. Uh, I place in the other side because this can get uh, hot, as this is a motor, so it is better to place the hang in the other side. Okay, now I will explain you why I chose a uh, Mach wheel over one wheel. Uh, basically, due to security. Uh, there are uh, two concepts of security. You can think about perceived security, how do you feel over this, but there is another very important, which is the signed 
security, the real security that this product is offering over other options, okay? In this case, you can see that the motor, it is asymmetric, okay? So, uh, this is designed in order that when you are not over the, the electric scooter, the electric scooter will fall to one of the sides and will not impact to any other place. So uh, this is something that it's happened with uh, one wheel because in one wheel, uh, you know that there is the ghosting effect and sometimes the one wheel doesn't know that you are out of the electric scooter and it's, it continues riding and impacts to any place, right? So uh, this is more secure product, okay? Uh, another thing that makes it more secure is that it has sensors uh, in one side and in the other side, okay? Uh, having sensors in the two sides makes that this product knows that you are over the, the, the electric scooter. So uh, when there is not a foot over one of these pads, the electric scooter stops, okay? So this is also a security measure, okay? In a one wheel, there are only uh, sensors in one of the sides. Uh, that's that allows people to jump and do more risky things, but at the same time, the electric scooter doesn't know many times if you are over, I mean, on the, the electric scooter or not, right? And this may result in ghosting, right? So uh, this product self-balances. When you are over, it is using gyroscopic uh, technology and also magnetic technology. This is why it is called a Mac wheel because it uses magnetic uh, technology and self-balances you. So it is very, very secure, right? And another uh, security measure of this product is that it has beep sound alert. So uh, when something is wrong, when it has fault, when you are not over it, is beeping, okay? And also when you are running out of battery, this starts to beep, so uh, you will avoid nose diving, which is also a very common issue with this kind of products, okay? So this has also the security measure of uh, these alerts of, of beeps, right? So uh, in case you are running out of battery, you will know it in, in advance. Another reason why I choose the Mac wheel is that this is an open ecosystem. You can find a replacement of these components. You can ask them and they will sell you these, these replacement components. And in one wheel, you know that this is a closed ecosystem. They try to be like Apple and you need to send to California your electric scooter in case it, it breaks. And you can imagine worldwide sending these electric scooters to to California, it doesn't make any sense. So this is a, also a very good reason why to choose uh, Mac wheel over one wheel. So yeah, uh, this is the Mac wheel. Uh, I love this product. I've been uh, using this for two days uh, and checking, uh, and I'm very, very happy with this. My purpose of using this product is for uh, surfing the streets, right? So urban surf, and also for filmmaking. I think this may be a very, very powerful tool for filmmaking. This is why I have uh, brought this product to this channel because we will be enjoying uh, in the next videos uh, how can this product be used for filmmaking purposes. And that's all from my side. I hope that you enjoyed this a uh, new product that I have brought to the channel. Stay tuned to this channel and you will see more videos on Mac wheel trotter in the next coming weeks. Cheers. <laughs>
Okay, now I am riding with the Mac Wheel T2 and I like this experience. It's like floating. I like it very much.